Hey guys, what is up? It is Zombie Killer X2 today here, guys, and today, guys, we are back on the Let's Build world. And last time we was on here, I showed you guys how to build this bike right here. So now, guys, I'm gonna be showing you how to build this basically modern apartment. Hold on, I got a little glitch. But um, yeah, so you can use it as a modern apartment, or you can make a hotel out of it. So yeah, guys, the materials you're gonna need to build this is you're gonna need oak fence, oak fence, block of quartz, pillar quartz, white stained glass, white stained glass pane. And dark oak wood planks. All right, guys. So basically, what we're gonna start out with is we're gonna take out our dark oak wood and take it over. Let's see: one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. And I think it's taking over fourteen blocks. Yep. Yeah. All right. And now we're gonna take it back. Hold on. Let's see here. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12. 14, 15. Okay, we're taking back 15 blocks. Alright, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Alright, now guys, let's make a square with it. And just fill the rest of it in. Pretty much. Just like this. Alright. Alright, now guys, what we're going to do is come back up to the front and we're going to leave one block out. And do this right here on both sides. So it's going to delete the whole middle. Once you do that, place um, the dark oak wood right there and one right there. And then get out white, get out your white stained glass and place two here, two here. All right. And then once you do that, take out your dark oak wood, do that, and do that. Then just take out your white stained glass panes and place them just like this. All right. So now, guys, we're going to take this uh, pillar, this up right here by four. So it's one, two, three four all right just now go ahead and fill in the glass up four all right and now just go ahead and do this all right, and now take this up by four and this up by four all right now take out your white stained glass panes and just place them just like that three up once you do that, take out your oak fence and break that one and place it just like that. These right here are like doors that have been opened to go into the building. So yeah, take your white stained glass pane, I'm sorry, white stained glass, and just go across on top. Once you do that, take out your pillared quartz block and go to the edge right here of this and just break it all the way down and just come up like that. Do it on both sides. All right, once you do that, now bring it up one more. And now take it across and make sure it's going sideways, not upwards. Once you do that, take your dark oak wood and place one on each end like this. Now take out your block of quartz and just bring it like this. All right, and now once you have that, that's mainly the bottom of the building. So now, guys, take back out your white stained glass and then do a... Do take it up forward just like this and get out your pillared quartz block and take it up four like that and then take out your dark oak wood and place it just like this up four and we're gonna do that on the exact on the other side too all right now I'll just surround it with this all right once you do that, take back out the white stained glass and place it four up again. And once you do that, take back out your dark oak wood and do this right here. Make it go out two right beside of the glass. All right, then get the white stained glass out again and just bring it all the way across and fill this in up four. All right, and that's that second part of the building. And now we're going to do the exact same thing like we did right here on this layer. We're going to bring that up one. And we're going to build it straight across. Just like that. And then take out the dark oak wood like that. And the block of quartz. And just bring them straight across like this. And then the dark oak wood. So yeah. So basically we're going to do three layers. We're, not, we're going to do three. We're not going to do four. Um... So yeah, so you can do you can do as many as you want. You can make this go to the sky limit as high as you want it. it. Don't 
it just you know I didn't put it like that because I think it's a little bit better smaller but you know it's up to you guys how you want to build it so basically we're just gonna do the exact same thing right here as we did we're gonna do the exact same thing right up here all right so just take it up four again and then just surround it with dark oak wood take your glass do this right here take it up four on each side take out your pillared quartz bring it up again alright take out your dark oak wood and just surround this again alright then put take the dark oak wood and put it just like this and I, I'm sorry I messed up here you're supposed to bring this back one Take your dark oak wood to do this right here. Then take the white stained glass and just put it like this. All right, and then we're just gonna take out the pillared. This this layer is gonna be a little bit different from these because this is gonna be the roof. Especially what we're gonna do is take out the block of, block of quartz and bring it straight across like this. And once you do that, just leave one on the end and then just do the same thing like this. And to do that, just go grab your pillared quartz block and come up one, up again, and then you come across. Make sure these are going sideways, not upwards. Once you do that, take out your dark oak wood planks. Bring actually don't do that. Take your block of quartz and put them on each side. And then we're gonna take the pillared quartz box just like this. So now guys, what you want to do is you just want to fill this in right here. That basically take the dark oak wood and just fill all this in but don't fill these corners in back here just break the block and leave it open so guys I'm gonna cut the recording right here and uh, I'm gonna fill this in and then I'm gonna start it back up when I get done just fill all this in and make sure to just cut the corners out alright guys I will see you when I get done alright guys we are back and I got this filled in so this is what it should look like when you get it done just filled in alright so now guys take the pillared quartz blocks back out and we're just going to do just straight up like this. Bring them all the way up to there. Do it on the other side too. Now once you do that, take out your block of quartz and just bring it just like this. And like I was saying guys, you can make this as tall as you want it to be. You don't have to be just three stories. You can make it 10, 20, it really don't even matter. It's... It's what you guys want to do. Alright, and then take the pillared quartz block up one like that. And now just take the keep the pillared quartz box on your hand and just do this. Bring it straight back. And on the edge, put up one and then make it like this. Alright. Do that and then bring it across. Alright guys, there you go. There's that done. So now what you want to do is take out the block of quartz and just fill this out in right here. This is the roof. And I may actually add maybe like a little bit of venting vents on the roof. Maybe like air conditioners and stuff like that. I don't know. We'll see when I get done. So just go ahead and fill this in. filled in here all right there we go guys so once you get that done oh, let me have a glitch here and once you get that done now just go inside and get, when you go to the main door this break these blocks right here and then you need to get our birch, birch wood points and just do this and then uh, delete this and then take out your block of quartz and place them under these windows because we're going to be doing the interior now alright and then just go ahead and break all of this and fill this and fill it in when you fill it in with the birch wood and 
And also, guys, you're going to need some more material. I will tell you that in a minute. So mainly, you can mainly get rid of, like, the glass and the quartz and stuff, I believe. I don't know. <laughs> oh, well, I'll point that later. All right, I got that broke, and now you just want to go ahead and fill it in. Let's get this done. And and there we go. Alright, so now guys what you want to do is um, just basically get, we can get some torches out, and we're going to place some, oh, I dropped it. Go ahead and place them like that on each of the corners, just like this. Alright, once you do that now guys, um, go ahead and get out an ups, a, um, <clears throat> quartz stair. And on each of the corners, place it upside down just like this, facing each other. Once you do that, go and get some spruce leaves and place them two on top of that. Alright, and once you have that, get, um, get back out the, the quartz there. And then from two over from this... Make sure they're upside down, just like the X. Bring them out two, and then curve them in, just like that. We're gonna do this on both sides. This is the counter, like you know, where you go down, you can like maybe say, "Hey, I want an apartment." Buy it. So yeah. And all right, there we go. So now what you wanna do is you wanna get out some oak, an oak wood stair. And, um, and we're going to use it for as a chair. We're going to place one there and one right here. All right, now what you want to do is you want to get out the ca some carpet. And you want to get out c cyan carpet. And you want to get out uh, just regular carpet, white carpet. What you want to do is on, just bring it over four like that. And then right here, basically a pattern just like this. And then I'll take out your white and place it in the middle like that and there we go guys that's mainly the down like the lobby area for the building so now you may want to get some ladders you can put stairs I'm just putting ladders for the time being alright and now what you want to do guys is get back out the um, birch wood birch wood and just make another floor And if you guys want to add your own decoration to this, it's you can, but I'm just doing this for people, you know, who's not the greatest at it. I'm not the best, but I wouldn't say I'm good at all. I would I'd give myself about a D about a I say about a C minus for interior decorating. Alright, once you get that filled in, go ahead and get back out and actually, no, take your um, dark oak wood and one over from this, just like, place it just like this, going all the way across. Once you do that, now find the middle and then just place a line like that. And we may need to get a uh, potion of night vision. Alright, and just do it, take it up four. <coughs> Like this. Once you do that, just fill this in like f by four or two. Once you do that, go ahead and break 
two like that, count two over, and then go up three. And do the exact same over here. Once you do that, um, make sure you get, so we need to get, so you need to get back dark oak wood stairs. Get those out, and you want to place these upside down like this. Once you do that, go over to the doors and get out a dark oak wood door. Or dark oak wood, yeah. <laughs> and then make sure you're facing this way to place them, and do that. Alright, and now what you want to do is get back out your dark oak wood. And pretty much just right where you put the wall at here, make another one, but make sure it doesn't, like on the side, make sure it's one off. And take it up four. Alright, what you want to do there is take out a block of quartz and just go straight across. And then go up two and go straight across. Once you do that, then you can get out a um, you can get out a furnace and break these two and place it like that. And then you could make a dining table, so place it like this. And then get out. Actually, have yeah, my inventory. Get out the oak wood stairs and then just make it like a little seats, like that. All right, and um. So yeah, this is going to go over here, so take out the dark oak wood plank and just go straight across. Alright, and then just do like this, like a little two space in the middle and then just delete the top. Once you do that, go over and then get out some gray wool and then place it in the middle. Just like that. And then you want to get out a painting. And then just make uh, put get a okay that's it works put a painting like that or if you want to you can make it a four by four TV a big TV like this and then get out some buttons and put on the side that looks better a lot better and then if you want to you could take a flower pot and then get some get a fern place one here and one in here and then put a fern on it. All right, now you're gonna what you're gonna need now is you're gonna need to get um wooden trapdoor and just gonna place it just like that and then just close them so we have that. Once you do that, now you're gonna need to make the um chair. So what you're gonna need is you're gonna need to get um right here light blue wool and make sure it's two back away from the TV. And then you're going to need to get some snow. Place two on top. And then make it, I see how many. One. Bring it up six. Just like that. And now take it out like that. One. And then take it up. Take it up four. So there you go. There's your little couch you can have. All right now, and so let's go into here. This will be your bathroom. So you need to get out the um, the quartz stair and do this right here. Just do two, one, make like that, and then there you go. Your little bathtub. Once you do that, now we're gonna make a toilet. So make sure you get a hopper out, place it like that. Get out a wooden trap door, put it there, and open it. If you want to, you can get a button and put it right here. And now what we're going to do is we're going to get an item frame out and a stone button and pillared quartz. This is going to be like the little toilet paper roll. I don't know what I want to do. Get another one out here. What you can do is you're going to place the button down first. Then the item frame, and then the pillar quartz, and you can turn, if you can turn it, make it sideways, and there you go, it's like your little uh, toilet paper roll. So then you want to go over here, make sure to get a hopper back out. Once you do, place two just like that, and then get an item frame, put two there, and then get a lever out, and place them just like that. 
So there you go, you guys. There's your little bathroom. So now this will be your bedroom over here. So what you want to do is here you want to get out spruce wood, a uh, slab and stairs. And you want to place one here and then one there. That and then place some like that. And pretty much it's like a little shelf thing where you can put your clothes in. You know, for pretend. Like that. And then on top. And then if you want to, you could get out a armor stand and place one there. And then you want to get back out your um, dark oak wood, place two on that side, put a fire pot there, and then get out of bed. Alright, once you do that, now get back out a fern, get a fern out, and then just place it in those. So there's the bedroom. And alright, so now you want to get a painting out. And we're going to add a little bit more decoration. And maybe place, actually place one in here on your bedroom. Maybe put that there, or you could, you got to try to get a two on here. Alright, put that there. And then if, when you go ahead and like fill the roof in, you can, what's from the roof, bring it, um, one like that, right over top of the table. And bring it out like that. Actually, never mind. We're not going to do that design. It's not fitting. So there you go, guys. That's how you build this. So you can go ahead and copy the four. Like, watch this back and then just copy this for the next one and how many you make. Or you can do your own design. Guys, if you liked the video, please leave a like and subscribe. And guys, I will see you in the next let build. Next, let's build. Bye.